Well, new at 10, neighbors say they are disgusted with a major rat infestation in Pasadena. Videos set to ABC 13 show the gigantic rodents clustered around one man's home, but they're getting onto other people's property as well. ABC 13's Daniela Artado spoke to the homeowner tonight and joins us live from Pasadena with more on this, Daniela. Eric, many of the neighbors we spoke to tell us this has been going on for a long time. They tell us and believe that the 82 year old homeowner has made these rats his pets. But we talked to the homeowner this evening and he tells us that's simply not the case. So where did these rats come from in the first place and why are they staying? Well, that's part of the mystery. Come at nine, four, nine o'clock at night and you can watch the Watch the rat show. Frustrated neighbors like Brenda King tell us the red two story home on Tizzledown Drive in Pasadena has a big rat problem. Never in my life seen anything like it. Video sent to ABC 13 shows a pack of them in a tree and others roaming on the neighbor's roof. Some neighbors believe the 82 year old man is providing water and food for the rodents to keep them around. I don't feed a rat. My wife doesn't like the rat, hate rats at all. I never, nobody, nobody wants to feed the rats. He calls himself an animal lover and owns 25 cats, but says cats and rats just simply don't mix and is adamant he's not keeping those rats as pets. He doesn't want them there either, but wants removal of them to be humane. He doesn't want to kill them. So, but we don't want to live with them. They're still not satisfied. Yesterday, the health department in the city of Pasadena told homeowner Vichin Kitawali he must get a pest control inspection and treatment within 72 hours. When are they going to come to do the inspection? Actually, I agree to come in by today. Tonight, the city of Pasadena tells ABC 13 he has until Monday to show significant progress in mitigating the rat infestation. They say the city is preparing their next steps if he does not comply. He's also on the hook for his more than two dozen cats. He was told 21 of them will need to be adopted out and is in talks with animal control to help him. And I hope it's taken care of immediately.